Hey guys, Squirrel Horse here, and welcome to Skyrim! So I want to start... Uh, <laughs> so for this first episode, what we're going to do is we're going to make our character, of course, which is me. And my character's going to be... Uh, I want to try to make a very well-rounded character, but I want to have an emphasis on magic. Because on my other playthroughs of Skyrim, I tried to have an emphasis on magic. And I just somehow, or for some reason or the other, just ended up not. So we're gonna try that. So I got the Novus Hood in the when the, the I should not talk so fast. I'd probably be better at it. So I got that the Novus Hood for magic. I got uh, leather boots just for the, just cause yeah. And we're just gonna wear normal clothes and gloves. So yeah, when I play when I play these kind of games, I like to put a big emphasis on like character creation and actual you know RPG stuff. So one of the mods that we have installed. You may notice there are bandoliers. So we're gonna be so for this episode what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be going out hunting with my handy dandy bow and arrow. And we're gonna go hunt for some animals and get some pelts and we're gonna make some bandoliers. Or is it bandoilers? I think it's bandoliers. Someone correct me. So yeah, I'm gonna be recording in bulk. Oh and we also have some other mods. We have the realistic needs mod, which adds uh Hunger, food, uh, and need to rest, all that, yada yada. And I've never actually tried them. I wonder if they have, like, actual items for sale? I know, and of course a new interface, which kind of throws me off, just because this is made for people who use the, the keyboard and mouse, and I actually use the controller, but it was required to use some mods, so what are you going to do? I don't mind it that much. Okay, so I wonder, is there a team right lead you to warm sands. I think, the hey, can I have that? Because we're probably going to need to sleep soon, because that's pretty important. Oh, here it is. Bedroll. So we need two cowhide and three leather. Ooh. Ooh. See, you know what? Oh, that, that's just a bottle, okay. So what is a, what's the difference between a ten and a bedroll? Well, I assume it's one's a ten, one's a bedroll, obviously, but yeah, I feel like we'll just get the bedroll. But we need. Okay, hopefully she's selling cows. Welcome, girl. Thanks you selling cows, Kiji. Is, is that was that a girl? I was listening to the voice. Cow pup, cow pup, cow pup, cow hide, cow hide is what I'm gonna say. I know. I don't have enough gold. So where should we go? This way. Okay, we could kill a cow. I don't think I've ever actually tried killing a cow that belongs to someone else in this game. For as long as I've had the game, on consoles of course, this is my first time playing it on the PC, so they were slightly thirsty and hungry. And if we stand in water, I have some refillable water bottles. I have to stand. So they should be... Empty bottle, what? Oh, okay, okay. So we need to be in there and we need to, okay, I get it, I get it. Okay, so I'm full now. So we're gonna go on a hunt for aminals. Which way should we go? <laughs> oh, that's me, I'm tired. Wait, 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 there's that. No, don't run away. Don't run away. No. Dang it. Okay, I'm a Breton. Do I have any magic I can use? No. So, I, um... I started to pursue the Companions quest line. And I started to do the College of Winterhold quest line. Because I was... What? Because I was gonna... No, get back here. Get back. Level up. Okay, we, we desperately need to... Get that. Let's get the health. Let's not be doing any magic early on. Okay, so we got the archery perk, overdraw. So do a bit more damage. Might be able to get this elk. Deer, whatever it is. Stop moving, stop moving. Oh, no, that's not gonna work. That would have been amazing if that hit. Get back here. 
Quit running into the mountains. Okay, okay, just gotta time this right. Oh, there he is, there he is, and oh, nope, nope. God dang it. What am I doing? What am I doing? The deer should be right. Okay, here he is, there he is, there he is. There we go. Okay. You got him. Deer hide and. Uh, let's just eat it. I usually eat all the, all the. I usually eat all the ingredients just to get all this, you know, alchemy stuff because I like to mess with alchemy sometimes. Maybe I'll do some stuff off camera. Like messing with alchemy and enchanting all the more boring skills because I want to make a really well rounded character. I don't know, maybe we'll, maybe we'll even do another let's play where I make another character and just do one play, one. I can't words. Where we just do one character and have like one life, you know, if I die, uh, then that part of the series is over. Okay. Oh, that's a wolf. This wolf is so... Something sees me. Let's see if we can snipe him. Okay, okay. Oh! Kill cam! Yes! Okay, you want some? There we go. I've been playing a lot of Dragon Age Inquisition and Dark Souls, so I'm trying to like do a strange amalgamation of those two games when I play this game. So bear with me, please. Yeah. So the goal of this episode is to get at least three Bandoiler things. At least for now. And then I'll show you guys like the customization customization that it allows you in that. Mm. What did I do? Okay. Let's get this mud crab. XP! What? Oh, I'm out of arrows. Well. Looks like we're gonna sort it away. Sort it. Okay, I'm gonna put- I'm gonna equip a magic. I'm going to equip a magic. Let's get that. You're dead. Let's see, I could use. I could use the legs so I can eat those. Yeah. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Yes, you got it. Killing animals. Yes. Hunting with lightning. How awesome is that? Hmm. Should we go after this? Shh, we're being stealthy. They won't even notice I'm coming in. Oh, I think I just got a steam trading card. Are these even bandits? Yes, they are. 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 Oh, yes, they are. Whoop! Dodge that arrow. Okay, let's grab a shield. Uh, sure. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna get this. You're gonna die. It's your lucky day. You get death. Okay, okay. I really need to sleep. Hopefully there's a bedroll in here somewhere. Okay, this is going pretty well. Okay, I've had worse. Let's take all their arrows. I don't know why I wasn't thinking about that. That's kind of something that's kind of essential. Considering I have to hunt in this episode. Which is which I've been recording for 19 minutes. But I cannot say for sure how much of it I cut out. 
Oh, they have arrows in them. That's nice of them. Oh, uh, I think he almost got an arrow to the knee. Must bring back the memes. Bring back all the Skyrim memes. Yes. Can we survive this fall? I guess so. Okay, well, it looks like we're gonna encounter our first dungeon. Fort Graymore. Graym yeah, more. That's how it's pronounced. So yeah, it's been quite a while since I've played Skyrim. Oh, I also have the realistic lighting effects, which this is my first time actually seeing them, and I am very happy with yeah, this module. Come here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, I'm sorry. R.I.P. Headphone users. Please don't kill me. He says as I kill him. See, that's why you don't. Mm, yeah. Okay. Oh, there's a burnt corpse. Okay, so yeah, I should, I should find, I should, I should, I was gonna eat that, but uh, I'll do that later. So yeah, it would definitely be beneficial. Oh wait, I have mage light, don't I? Because I needed it for the, because I needed it for the College of Winterhold. Okay, so this will come in handy. Game froze. I thought I, I thought I broke the game. Right here. Gold. Still ingot. Yeah, we're gonna be crafting. Wow, this is so cool. Ah. This is like really tense now because I'm actually like worried about like oh what's in the dark. Oh, you know I, I was considering not going into the dungeon because of the goal of this episode, but wow. Ah. Time to end this little game. Uh, I actually think that we should keep this game going on for as long as we can have it. Mm. Oh, with the shield, it wasn't even sharp at the end. Dang, so dark. Please tell me there's going to be a torch in here somewhere, because that would be very beneficial. Time to end this little game. Oh, wow, oh, wow, oh, wow. Someone do something. That's your best. Does he have anything I can use on him? Nope. Of course not. Did I just hear someone say, someone do something? Hmm. Yeah, I really wish that I had more magic. Because it'd be more beneficial to me if I could just spam cast Mage Light right now. But I can't. What was this? I just cook and clean and do whatever it is that... I can't even keep track of all the people who have been in and out of this fort. They come, they go. I barely notice. Huh. Hard enough to keep up with who owns this fort. One side takes over, the other runs away. I tell them, I ain't leaving. I come with the place. Ha! Okay, cool. Good for you. Oh, I can sleep. We're gonna sleep for three hours because we're really tired. And, I just cook yeah. and clean and do whatever it is they ask of me. What's in here? Any pelts? Oh, we can get clothes. Oh my gosh, customization! I'm actually pretty okay with this for now. For my in town. Not really doing anything attire. You've been noticed. Make me. The second I thought he grabbed me, and I was like, what? Okay, we got this. It's an archer in here somewhere. Okay, okay. What? Is there another person? I don't see him. It is so dark. It's kind of awesome. 
It's adding tension to it. Maybe that's just a glitch? I don't see another person. Okay, cool. I'm about to die! Yes. God dang it. I noticed when I was about to heal and then I died. So I think that's all we need from this fort for now. Maybe we'll come back later. Potions. We need those. Anything on these? Okay, it's, it's dark again. So we're just gonna make our way out. I should say find our way out. I will be back with you once I am out. Okay, so now we are outside again. I don't know if the bandit's gonna follow us or not. Probably not. So I'm gonna double check and make sure that there's no tanning rack around here, because it seemed like a good place to put a tanning rack. Oh, here's the tanning rack, right here. Okay. So let's see. We're gonna make some leather. I think all the leather. And we have enough for some bandoilers. Okay. So, as you can see, there's a bunch of different things. And you can get pretty specific with where you want to put it. Like side left, side right, front right, front left. Okay, so we're going to see how many of these we can craft. I kind of want a vial one. Just because, as I said, I want to kind of put an emphasis on the... I want to try to be very well-rounded, of course. So I want to put an emphasis... A little bit of an emphasis on the alchemy. So how do I want that to be? Let's see. See, I don't know how these are going to look. That's the other thing, so... Okay. Okay, so now we should have some bandoilers. <coughs> Until we... Oh, yeah. That's kind of cool. So, yeah, this is the bandoiler mod. That seems to have been the main focus in this episode. So that's what I'm going to be linking in the description. So if you want to check that out for yourselves, by all means, go ahead. And anyway, we're going to end this episode here for now. So have a lovely day, and I'll hopefully see you next time. Bye!